Well, get you some rich friends that can give you like an old Louis Vuitton bag so that you can work. That's my best advice. Um, yeah, that's all I got right now. Get you some rich friends. <laughs> Yeah, all that. This is uh, my interpretation of the happy face. I guess, like in a way, I am my own influence because, like, um, all of this is called paintings. I'm kind of uncomfortable with that term, paintings. But all of these paintings are like very graphical, right? Um, they are not trying to mimic real life. This is not a real face. Um, they are a feeling. That's what it is. They are a feeling, right? So I'm like, okay, what is the feeling that I'm trying to communicate? And then I'll do it this size. Then I'll do it this, I'll do it this size like 30 times. Once I nail down the doodle, I'll do it this size 30 more times. So however long. Then I go digital, because digital, you don't waste paper and waste like resources. So I'll do it in the iPad like endless times. And in the iPad, you can actually say, okay, let me see these eyes with this mouth. And let me see all these different combinations, kind of like an NFT. Very, very graphical. Then once I, re once I get the one, I'm like, okay, well, let's make them this size. And I make them all like this. And that's what you'll see in my process wall um, during the show. And once I go through the process, I make like 20, 50. Sometimes I make two processes and I'm like, oh, shit, that's the one. Once I get the one, then it goes bigger. This piece right here, um, this is going to sound weird, but I downloaded this from out there. Um, this image kind of showed up to me. This, right, specifically the, the globe. Um, this is like my interpretation of like um, the concept of like the hive mind, like um, the hive mind being like a collective consciousness versus an individual consciousness. 